What's up guys? So I'm getting a little bit later start in the day than normal. It's already like 1130. Um, I'm pretty much just spending all day. I've been spending all day like editing and all that and I, uh, I cleaned up my room and all that. And so now I'm finally getting the day started. Um, there was a place in Macon when we went to move conference. I saw it was like this big building that had one of the whole walls like knocked out of it and it was covered up so i thought that could be like a great spot to do some like diy stuff since i don't know if i told you guys but the spot that i built down there some people bought that lot it was like abandoned for like three or four years and then finally when i started using it someone buys it and so now um all, that's gonna get torn down and they're like building a house down there and everything so that kind of bums me out but i found this new spot and i'm gonna go check it out and i thought it'd be a great idea to bring you guys and there's also this other building next to it that's like some odd levels high that i saw a way to get into it so i'm also going to explore that and hopefully we don't run into any uh strange strangers whoa all right guys, so I'm here. Uh, this place is way cooler than I expected it to be. Um, it's pretty much like this big empty warehouse. That's just, uh, there is holes in the ceiling though, so it does like leak. The ground is wet, very wet. Um, but like on a dry day, if you came out here with like a broom, you could legit clean like half of this up and like 20 30 minutes and then just start building uh it's a super rad place that i hope i hope that i can get some of the dudes that like like building diy stuff and we can come out here and clean this place up i think it'd be super nice uh there's tons of room to do pretty much whatever we want um there's concrete walls that we can build like small quarter pipes on and everything so i'm very excited let me turn the brightness up. I'm very excited of what we possibly could do with this place. There is somewhere right over there where there's like a, a door that's and it's really dark on the inside of it. And I'm going to go check it out and see what's in there. If I can maneuver through this place without like getting soaked. I'm wearing my skate shoes. So they do have like a massive hole in the side of them that uh, I would like to not get very wet. But I'm going to just like take some shots of the place and let you guys see it and uh if there's anyone that's watching this video that wants to try to build here just hit me up and like we can come out here and scope it out and everything and see what we want to do like i said though there is water everywhere and it there's a lot of it coming in over there so i'm going to see if i can make my way back here without getting myself soaking wet. All right, guys, so y'all saw that there, there's a ton of like uh, bricks and everything out there that we can use to build stuff. So that would make it a little easier. And then a little ways over there, I saw a uh, like stair set that had a rail. I don't know if it's skatable. I'm going to try to get over there. It is kind of raining outside. So I'm going to try to like cover my camera and work my way over there and then uncover the camera and show y'all and everything. I don't want to just walk through the rain in it because I do want to try to avoid ruining my camera. All right guys, so this is actually a pretty gnarly spot. See, here's the rail. That's your, here I'll show you the run up you're working with. There's this right here to this first set, but then you come down and you have to like immediately hit that. So I don't know if there's anyone that wants to skate it and there's also a bunch of like dirt and everything down there so I don't know if it's logical to try to skate it but I'm sure there's someone out there that could and here's kind of what's around the place 
it's kind of uh, vacant, except for what whatever's over there. But I don't think, and there's the building. That was the section of it that I didn't go in. It was really dark, and I'm by myself, and you know, worried. But here's this, and there's also all this ground out here and everything, and there's that truck. There's no one in the truck I already checked. All right, guys, so I think that would be a super rad place to try to start, like, building a DIY spot and everything. Uh, if y'all agree, please like this video, comment, and say that'd be super rad. If you want to see me do it, then just be like, dude, do it! And I'll come out here one day and, like, start cleaning it up and everything and see what we could possibly do. All I have is my Subaru to try to, like, lug stuff around in, so if there's anyone that has like anything they want to bring out here that's really big you'd have to find your own way to get it out here but uh, if you want to know also want to know where it is then just leave a comment in the description and I'll like message you on YouTube or if I know you personally I'll text you or your Instagram leave your Instagram and I'll like pin it to you or whatever so you can come out here and check it out and we could possibly start doing this thing but for right now there's this other building right here that I'm gonna go explore. There's a way into it, and there's also some stairs right there. The door up top is, it's not really a door, it's like a window that got concreted off. So you can't get in right there, but I'm gonna try to go in the front of it. All right guys, so here's the road. So I'm not too worried about like, oh, that was a lot of water. Yeah, my shoes are wet now. Oh, heck, man. That is deep. I have to find a way to get around. I'm going to have to go up there and go around. So, I'll be right back, guys. Oh, I got to go back. All right, guys. So, I am alone going in here. So, if you never see this video, it's probably because either A, I didn't make it, B, I was really scared of what was in here, or C, uh, the people in there said that if I ever upload this video, then they'd kill me. So, if you don't see this video, Here's the entrance, guys. Oh man, that is some horrifying scary. All right guys, we're going in. It's really cold in there. Hope there's no one in here. All right guys, I'm in. I probably should have brought a flashlight. So I'm gonna go back, not explore this building because I can't see anything. And I'll come back one day when I have a flashlight. All right guys, so that was a bit of a bummer. I really wanted to go in there and explore around and stuff, but it's very dark. Like there's no way for light to get in. Every single window is blocked off and all the ones like up top blocked off. Everything's boarded off. That's the only way in. I did see some light coming from the back, so I'm gonna go check that out and see what that's all about. Um, but I'm gonna go like get a flashlight one day and come back here and explore it, so stay tuned for that. Here's, I think this is where the light was coming in. Here it is. Oh, there's also light coming from the top up there. You guys can't see it, but yeah, oh, yeah, that's it. Now I'm gonna go and climb those stairs. They don't lead to anywhere because everything's blocked off up there. Yeah, see, that's, oh, it had an elevator, and that's where the light was coming from. But yeah, so I'm gonna go climb those stairs real quick. I hope I don't step in any, like, huge puddles walking through this grass, because that'd be a bummer, but, Oh, dude, how the heck am I supposed to get to that? Look at it. Oh, you can see how people were getting to it right there. If I was, if I had someone else here, I'd do it because then I could take you guys with me, but I can't get up there. I could get up there, but then you guys wouldn't be able to come, so it'd be a waste. But. We're gonna come back here. 
definitely gonna come back here and really explore this place because I like doing that and you guys seem to like it from the number of views and likes and everything so if you want me to come back and do all this stuff just leave a like leave a comment and say you're killing it not you're killing it like go kill it as in like check the place out uh, there's the bridge over there that I'll, I also might go check that out. I don't know if you guys can see it. No, you can't. But I'm going to go look at that too since now I'm in the exploring mood. I might as well. Alright guys, so as I was walking back here I saw this thing right here and it doesn't look like there's a lock on it so I'm gonna see if I can get in there and see what's going on this one doesn't have a lock on it's been broken off pretty recently well now it's rusted so let's just see I think it slides we're in guys oh god guys there was someone in there holy crap holy crap I'm getting out of here oh my gosh guys, oh god oh jeez I don't want to do it I don't want to do it anymore I'm leaving. I'm leaving. Oh man. Oh gosh. Alright guys. So that was a little scary. Oh man. I opened it and then all of a sudden I started hearing like quick, 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 like shoes squeaking in the water and all that. And I was like, yeah, I gotta get out of here. I don't know. I don't know who's in there. Oh man, now I'm exhausted. Oh my knees got dirty. Good thing I didn't fall or anything while I was running. That was exhausting. Now let's, I'm gonna go find somewhere else to explore. They look like there was another building over there. And I'm gonna go over there rather than stay here. All right guys, so that did not go as planned at all. In case you're wondering what happened, uh, there was this, I was walking back to the train tracks because I was going to climb up there and try to get some shots or whatever. And I saw this building that had some like doors on it. And I saw one of them was the chain lock had been like busted off. And I was like, I might as well go check it out. And I went over there and I was pulling on the door and I realized it was a slide door. So I pushed it. And as soon as I got it open, I was just standing there listening. And all of a sudden I started hearing like, you know, when shoes are wet and you're walking on water, how it makes that like sound. Um, yeah, I started hearing that and I started hearing like footsteps and I was like, oh, no, 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 no. So I like pulled the thing shut really fast and I just took off. I was like, I don't want to do this. I don't want to, I don't want to mess with these guys. So I was out of there. But luckily I found two other buildings that I can go explore. So I'm going to go do that real quick. All right, guys. So both the front and the back door of this first place are like busted in and like all the windows are broken out. So I'm pretty sure no one lives here and I hope no one's going to be here. But we're going to try to get up there regardless. All right, here's the building, guys. See, here's the window got, that got torn out. Let's go inside now. I'm not going to go too far in the house. There's a ladder. 
going into the attic. So someone might live up there. Hmm, we're back on the outside. Hey look, another building. Or it's another way into the same house. Is that building? Hey, there's another one over there, but I'm probably gonna stop here because now I keep hearing stuff and I don't know if it's just me or if it's actual things, but now I'm starting to freak myself out. So we're gonna head back to the car now and that is it. Hope y'all enjoyed the little bit of touring that I did through some abandoned places in Macon. Um, I don't think this is a good, like, area to just kind of walk around with this expensive camera, like, waving it around and stuff, but it's all for you guys, so I hope y'all enjoy it. I hope you, uh, learn something from this, as in, like, don't do the things that, uh, I'm doing, because, as you saw, there were a few consequences. One... Uh, got scared out of that one place, so uh, Just let me do this guys unless there's someone else out there That's like making videos for people to like entertain them and everything cool But if you're on your own and you're like younger, especially Let's try to avoid doing this stuff. Um, I did it when I was younger uh, I got I've gotten in a lot of trouble doing it and I've made a bunch of people mad because of it so please ref refrain from doing anything of the sorts that you uh, have seen me do on my channel like this stuff and then some of the other things where I went exploring in like houses and stuff and we found out a few of them weren't abandoned so breaking and entering is against the law guys so don't do it I hope you all enjoyed this video if you did please leave a comment like subscribe it would all be very much appreciated um, and also the spot that I went to in Macon where I was thinking about doing the DIY stuff tomorrow's video I'll be saying that same thing but there's also a place in Warner Robins that I'm gonna go and check out that I'm gonna see if it could potentially be a little better uh, it seems a little easier to clean up there's not as much water and everything and it's also closer to my house and all that so I won't have to go as far. I'll of course be limited by space and everything and I'll probably have to do everything like either really early in the morning or a little bit later at night before it gets dark. Um, or like, I don't know about midday because it is kind of in a visible spot and I don't want the cops to get called or anything like super early on in me trying to do anything. So not tomorrow's video for me it'll be tomorrow but not tomorrow's video the day after um it's all super confusing but um i'm going to be going to that spot and like checking it out and probably trying to clean it up a little bit to see what i have to work with and all that so stay tuned for that there's going to be some more diy stuff going on and sorry for the lack of skating here recently um i'm about to start college and everything and uh, I've had a lot of stuff going on, so I haven't really got the chance to film it. I have skated, but it's just kind of hard to... If I just want to go out and go skate for like 10 or 15 minutes, it feels redundant. It feels pointless to kind of pull out the camera and only film that when uh, I probably couldn't land that much stuff if I have to move the camera around and everything in 15 minutes. So I hope you guys understand, but I still hope you're enjoying the videos and everything. If you are, please... Uh, thumbs up this video leave a comment share this this video. It'll all be super cool, but until next time guys. Bye